All right, in, in order for a series to converge, r has to be a fraction, either a positive or negative fraction. And so we look at this sequence. We can tell that they're going down. They're getting cut in half. So that makes, sorry, that makes r equal to, um, r equals negative one half in this case, because these numbers are 16 minus 8, and then positive 4, and then minus 2. So since they're alternating signs, that makes the ratio negative, but it is being multiplied by 1 half. So that's going to mean these numbers eventually are going to get so close to 0 that they're not going to affect anything in the series when we add them up. And so we have this formula where you take the first term and divide by 1 minus the common ratio, which in this case is negative, and this will give us the, the number that it converges to. So we just have to do 16 and then 1 plus 1 half. And I can do this on my calculator pretty easily. 16, 1 plus 1 half, or you can type in 0 0.5. And this would be, as a fraction, 32 over 3. Because if I, if I want this as a decimal, it's going to be, whoops, answer decimal. It's going to be a repeated number, 10.6. And that's hard to type into. You can't type this into quizzes that way. So you could answer in general either way. Just don't round it off because this number is a rational number. You can write it as a fraction.